Hello and welcome to my next reading vlog. I have been making a lot of reading vlogs, a lot of them. It's kind of, my chin's like breaking out right now. It's kind of been a way to stabilize my life a little bit. I don't know, it just, it grounds me for some reason. So this is going to be my next vlog and it is going to be the Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire reading vlog. This is my first time reading the Goblet of Fire. My first time reading all the Harry Potter books. I'm 27 and I've still never read this entire series. So I plan on starting this this afternoon. So welcome to my Goblet of Fire reading vlog and I'll check in with you guys a little later. Bye! flattering isn't it um it is sunday <laughs> i just woke up i've done absolutely nothing with myself i haven't even gotten out of bed here i am um last night i only read one chapter of the goblet of fire it's over here on my nightstand okay. and the first chapter is already so different so this is good this is good I wasn't a huge fan of the movie The Goblet of Fire, so we'll bring the book I like a little bit more. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. Oh boy, 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 boy. Okay. So yes, I do want to read more of that today, but yesterday I watched a lot of Netflix. I caught up with Boruto. I watched Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I watched Naruto the movie Bonds, which is one I don't remember seeing before. I thought I've seen all of them, but maybe not. What is this? It's a sock! Oh, Sean has socks in the bed. Gross. I also watched something else. What was it? Maybe just Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? I don't know. I think I, I think I did footage that you guys all just watched. So yeah, that's what I watched. And I finished ed editing one of my videos. I do want to get that up. It's a video that I have scheduled for the very end of the month. So I want to edit and schedule another video today. I have a video filmed and I have a vlog completed that I have to edit those two and then I can schedule them. Besides that, uh, here we are. <sighs> wow, this is probably the most unflattering clip of me ever. I saying I'm going to edit a video or two and read, but I'll probably just sit here all day and watch Netflix. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay. I'm also trying to not be too nervous because I have my procedure tomorrow, but we'll see how that goes. So um, yeah, I'll uh, check in later. Bye! <music> Monday. I am currently playing Animal Crossing and uploading a video to schedule for tomorrow and that baby is processing. So it's done uploading. It just needs to process. But that is my stay-at-home book tag created by Princess of Paperback aka Madison and Mary. And yeah, I also want to edit a vlog either tonight or tomorrow and have that scheduled for Thursday. And then I have um, my Pokemon Raid Readathon TBR already done, except for a graphic that I'm waiting on Meg from Tom Infinity to get me. Um, and I should have that up, I think, on Tuesday. So I think I want to start uploading on Tuesdays and Thursdays, just because it's been working for me recently for some reason. And part of me wants to bring up a calendar. Google. Google. Okay, so post my tag tomorrow, the 21st. Um, the vlog that I need to edit on the 23rd, which is Thursday. And then my TBR video on the 28th. And then I'll need to 
record and post something for the 30th and that'll be like two weeks worth of videos i've been doing so good uploading lately and i'm really proud of myself and i think i'll leave saturdays for like bonus uploads like if i have something extra but yeah i had my procedure today um it was rough it was very painful and then the first few hours after the procedure were painful but i'm feeling pretty good now and it's 5 p.m and my procedure was at 8 30. i'm feeling pretty good right now like i feel fine so this is fantastic i'm feeling good but besides that i had some comfort food i bought flaming hot cheetos some nerd ropes um vanilla coke and Reese's peanut butter cups and then I got five guys for lunch so I went full on comfort today but yes here I am my switch my laptop my cat and uh my vanilla coke so here we are I still have only read one chapter of Harry Potter I came home and I watched some Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I've been doing lazy stuff though I did edit that video today so I can say that I did at least one productive thing. My workplace, I work at a university in the study abroad office and as you can guess we're getting hit pretty hard so I may or may not be furloughed so update on that. Uh, I'm moving across the world and I might be furloughed. I'm panicking just a little bit so here we are. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay yeah before this gets too depressing I'll talk to you guys all later. <laughs> first if I'm not mistaken. Just a little update. I read until page 100, no not 100. Wow sorry I slowed down. 51, just 51 not 151 which is chapter 5 so I am going to read chapter 5 today. Um, it's already so different like the first five chapters are so different. The first chapter is like it's like the same as what happens in the movie with like the like haunted house part except it goes into way more detail and then after that how harry leaves the dursleys to go to the world quidditch cup with the weasley family that is completely different but i loved it i was smiling i was enjoying it but yeah so it kind of has been motivating me to want to read this because if you've been on my channel for any amount of time, you know that I have trouble reading books after I've already seen the movies. I don't like when I already know what's going to happen. But only five chapters in and this is like completely different. So I don't know what to expect and it's making me really motivated to actually pick the book up. So now that I know that, I'm going to be a tad more um, motivated to read it um but i want to read this by the start of may because i am co-hosting the bookiemon raid readathon wow i have so many clothes there <laughs> and i want to start off with like zero books being currently read so i just want to get through this one um i am currently reading um game of thrones clash of kings audiobook but i'm waiting for that rental to come back in through um, Overdrive because I didn't listen to it in the amount of time that my hold was for for Overdrive. So I just need to um, get through that. But yes, I have a video going up today. I need to edit a vlog that should be going up Thursday. And then my Pokemon Raid TBR should be going up a week from today. So next Tuesday. So yes, that is my check-in. I hope you guys all enjoy the week. Um, I may or may not be getting bad news this week. I may be furloughed. So um, we're just going to take it one day at a time. <laughs> I'm, you know, panicking a little. Um, but okay. Yes, here I am. Also, my procedure, I feel completely 100% fine today, which is great. Yeah, I don't want to die today. So that is great. So far, I'm happy with the outcome. And it's just been 24 hours. So here we are. <laughs> okay. Bye.
it is the 23rd, Thursday. Um, it's lunchtime. I am getting Tom's drive-in. Everywhere else is clearly closed. I'm in the drive-thru. Yeah. Haven't been checking in. I haven't really been reading. I read an additional chapter last night of Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. I'm really liking it. I feel like the characters have more depth in the book than the movies. Like the scene where Cedric's dad meets Harry. Um, all the Weasley um, siblings all have a lot more depth in their characters and so I'm really liking that part of the book so far. I'm obviously not very far. I think I'm on page like seven something or another um, but I'm really liking it. I'm really liking like I said like the depth of the characters, um, their interactions, their relationship and it's just fantastic. I love it. But yes I have been working non-stop today except for lunch now because I found out I'm being furloughed so I'm being furloughed meaning that after next week I am not working so I'm trying to leave my co-workers with as much done as possible and I'm trying to get some resources together for them as well for me being gone until potentially August 31st and if I'm gone till August 31st I'm probably not going to go back if I'm still leaving on September 8th to Japan so we're just gonna have to see at this point I'm not I'm not completely sure how that's gonna work, but that's that's where we are. Now I am <sighs> almost my turn. I just wanted burger and fries. That's that's what I wanted. Burgers, fries, cheese curds. That's what I want. My hormones are all over the place from that procedure I had on Monday, and yeah, I'm just craving everything under the sky. Like everything. Like I want everything. So here we are. <laughs> okay, I just ordered, but this might be like first world problems, like here I am. But I'm driving Sean's Jeep instead of my VW and his like window is like automatic down but it's not automatic back up. <laughs> it's just driving me nuts. I hate it. My auto is auto up and down so here we are. Should have just drove my car. Yeah. I feel taller in the Jeep though. Here we are. My hair is super fluffy. But right now, I, for the rest of my lunch period, I am playing Animal Crossing. I just finished my toms, and yes, there was an update. So this is what I'll probably be doing all night after work. Again, probably not reading. Are we surprised? Probs not. Hello, it's like 4.55. I'm working on my bullet journal for May, and I'm gonna show you a quick sneak peek, but I think I'm gonna have like an entire like video up just for the spread. But yes, I need to catch up on making videos for my bullet journal spreads. So not sure what I'm gonna do to catch up, but probably just like a flip through. I don't know, we'll have to see. But here it is. I'm going with pastel colors and breakfast. Look at this toast, it has like a little bite out of it, little eggs, and there's that. I think I like it. I don't like it as much as last month's, but I do like it. So yeah, we'll have to see. But yeah, so the rest of the night I'm going to probably just play Animal Crossing and read my like one chapter of The Goblet of Fire. I don't know. I'm not feeling super motivated to do anything at all. So I guess we'll have to see. Okay. Yeah, that's an update. Sort of not an update, but an update, I guess. Okay, bye. <laughs> Okay, I'm in the car. I love driving my car now. Now that like, I have no reason to drive it, I was like, I have errands to run today. Yes, errands. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I wanna drive my car. Cause last time I went out, I drove Sean's Jeep and like, no. So <sighs> today I have plans. So last night I posted on Twitter if anyone wanted to do like a 24 hour like read-a-thon with me. And I got some people to, like, didn't get people to say yes, but people did say I would be interested. I'm going to be doing a 24 hour readathon and it's going to start at 2 p.m. my time, which is central, and then 3 p.m. Eastern, and then noon, whatever California time is Pacific, Pacific Standard, I think. I'm not sure. Um, but Princess from Castle Library, Margaret from The Word Nerd, and then Soleil from The Re Little Reader's Corner said they were interested. And so 
I, we're going to maybe possibly do that. Some other people like liked the tweet, so I don't know. But it's just going to be super simple. That's what my next vlog is going to be. But I need to finish off this vlog in like today. So, so I am on my way to pick up my library holds. They're doing curbside pickup and my time slot is 12.30. It is currently 12.08. And then I'm going to go to Walgreens because like no one is ever at Walgreens during this pandemic. So instead of going to like Walmart or Target or something, I've been going to like Walgreens or CVS because like no one's there, which is great. And then I am going to be going to like McDonald's drive-thru or something for lunch. Uh, but yeah, those are the three things I am going to be doing this afternoon. And uh, yeah, I brought like uh, disinfectant wipes to like <laughs> wipe down my library books and stuff like that and like open the coolers at uh, Walgreens. So don't worry, I'm being safe. Sort of. <gasps> okay, where are my Mickey and Donald shirt? I got it for Donald, not for Mickey. I'm a Donald stan. Okay. So I just cleaned off my books like you saw, my manga. Yona of the Dawn volumes four and five. So I did also put on hold number six, but they must, whoever had it before me must not have returned it because they were doing like in like inter um, library exchanges. So I go to one library, but they have to ship it from a different library for me to get this series. So it's kind of where I am at at the moment. Um, and then I just got to Walgreens. I'm going to go in for some stuff. Um, Sean also let me know that we need toilet paper. So hopefully, hopefully I can find some toilet paper. Who would have thought that this would have been the one thing people couldn't find? Fresh meat and toilet paper. I don't know. Toilet paper is essential, but like not to be able to find it for weeks just seems obnoxious. Where did it all go? That's the question. But yes, I'm gonna go in there. So I'm gonna take my Clorox wipes with me because if I open a cooler to get like a soda or something, I use these when I'm out and about. But yes, so here we are, here we are. Okay, hello. Um, I'm in the drive through line for McDonald's now. And yeah, I guess I'll just update you now. Um, so I was thinking about scrapping this entire vlog because I'm in a huge reading slump. This is supposed to be like my Goblet of Fire reading vlog, but like I've only read like 75 pages. But you know what? Reading slumps are part of being a reader, a part of being a booktuber, and it's just the reality of life. So this is just going to be like a reading slump vlog, I guess. I'm not going to call it the Goblet of Fire reading vlog because I haven't read anything. But since I am starting my 24 hour readathon in about an hour and 15 minutes, I have kind of like a TBR I've set for myself. So I'm going to do that and I have goals. So stay tuned for that vlog because that's when I want to kind of pick up reading again. I am going to be reading a little bit of Goblet of Fire, but I also have like Yona of the Dawn. I want to read volume four of that. And then I also have this like short novella novel thing. I don't know. It's confusing that I want to read also. So um, that's kind of where I'm at right now. And I think that's fine. I'm not going to get rid of this, this, um, this vlog footage. I'm just gonna have it be a vlog um, because it's just, it's the reality of life. And I'm going to have to accept that, yes, I'm a booktuber. No, I'm not always going to be reading. So if you guys are really disappointed in this vlog, I am so sorry. I will label it so no one is, I don't know, fooled by what this vlog is supposed to be. But yes, I am going to order my McDonald's and then drive home, eat it, and then start my 24 hour readathon vlog. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please like, comment, and subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I will see you guys all in my next video. Is anyone else in a reading slump? Those are the important questions. But see you guys all later. Bye.